Okay, hello. This is going to be super, super echoey. Like the most echoey video I've ever made in my life. Um, I'm in like the vault part of the guardianship that I live in. Uh, so there's just this random block room. And so I'm going to use it to uh, repaint my docks. <laughs> my dock yeah, It's this strange like white sparkly color. And I mean, people like that, that's fine. But it's definitely not my look. And I'd rather wear it with a lot more things than I can. So I am going to paint them. So I'm going to sand it down and then I'm going to spray paint it and then do something funky on it. I don't know what that is yet, but yep. <laughs> okay. Okay, you recording? Sick. Okay, so. Docks, fancy docks. Sand paper. Okay, so the plan is to use fabric and put it in the part where your foot goes just so I don't get all the paint all over it. Alright. Okay, so don't mind the noise, you might be able to hear the street. I started the boots by just wiping down all of the extra graffiti. I had a lot of paint that was kind of stuck to the bottom of the shoe, or boot, or whatever you want to call it. And so I just started by wiping those off and cleaning it up with some black paint and some white paint just to fill in the gaps of anywhere that missed. I ended up running out of the <laughs> spray paint while I was spray painting it so one is a little more spray painted the, than the other which I quite liked actually I had this idea to do roses so obviously I started doing white roses because it's easier on fabric if you do it in white first this fabric was actually really really easy to work with way easier than I expected it to and it just kind of stuck to it so I'll varnish it after of course to keep it all in place but it stuck to the shoe really well and blended really well almost very like a canvas so it was really easy to work with I then ended up doing <coughs> sorry I'm a little sick <laughs> I did a little bit of color in it until I realized that I really liked the pink and started doing more pink in there instead I didn't know what style exactly I wanted to go for, but I was thinking more aimed towards a painter's style, which didn't end up happening the way that I wanted it to, which is fine, that's perfectly fine. Um, I'll probably go through it after and do more of a painter's style, but until then, I just ended up doing with a little bit more detail, a, mostly with outlines rather than shading and things, so it kind of had an almost unfinished look was kind of what I was more aimed towards. I liked the placement of where I put the roses. I think it kind of worked well and kind of flowed well. I filled in the gaps with these little roses just to fill in some space and ended up adding some more after that I found more fit. Okay, so I am done. <laughs> I finally finished them and I think I'm decently happy with the final result. I did it a little more graphic than I thought I would, so I don't know how I feel about that and I'd rather have like a painter's sort of style, but that wasn't working when I was doing it and it was taking too much time, so I'll probably do that in the future, maybe touch them up and do that when I actually have more time to sit down and do that, but for now it's just kind of more graphic and outlined, but I'm decently happy with it and I'll probably wear them around and yeah. It was a really fun project, so I'll probably paint some more shoes in the future. And yeah, thank you for sticking around or checking it out or whatever you're doing today. And enjoy your day and go paint some shoes. Okay, bye.